I'm in the airport. I've got my lunch, and we're heading out to Paris. You and I, we're going. Let's go. So we're just only laying over in Paris. I'm actually going to Dublin, Ireland. Look at this Christmas, look at the Christmas decorations. I'm here with John Lyde, my friend and business partner, and we are going to be flying very soon. I'm tempted to go get a, a fun pick over there. It's been a while since we've been on a plane that has a middle aisle. 10 hours, 20 minutes. Where our elbows are now merged as one. We just got off at Charles de Gaulle, Paris, France, airport. Lay over for an hour and 20 minutes and then fly some more westernly over to Dublin. So I'm gonna have to get a quick look at Paris here. Stick my head out the window, but it's totally foggy here, so we're not gonna see much. We have to board pretty soon and we had to go back through security. They took everything out of my bag. And look, there's an arcade right there, right inside the uh, terminal. There's a lot of people playing it too. I wonder if it's a free arcade. This would be probably the one and only hour that, I'm, that I've ever been in France and may ever be again. This will be my first and only experience in Paris. But I can't see anything. I can't poke my head out a window and look at the Eiffel Tower or see Paris Disney or the Louvre or something. They're selling lighters in the gift shop right at the terminal. Seems like a bit of a security reach, isn't it? I don't know. Yeah, I got a couple little Eiffel Tower magnets. You have to show them your passport to buy out, buy here. Overpriced, but I'll never be here again. So I had to get them. And they started boarding two minutes ago. Let's see if anyone's still there. We gotta get onto another plane. Never to see Paris again, ever. Okay, maybe we will. Let's come back one day. Paris is out there somewhere. Dublin, du beau temps sur le parcours, à l'arrivée à Dublin, un petit peu le même type de temps, assez brumeux. Ok, we just disembarked and it's just as described here, cold and wet. Where is John? Where is he? <laughs> At the car rental place, <coughs> very, as they said, wet and wet and wet and cold. And we've got this hatchback. It's a it's a Skoda. I've never seen a Skoda. Okay, so this should be fun. <laughs> <Are you? laughs> this is so weird. Where's the bike? Where, where's the... You want me to shift for you? I can shift really easy for you. Yeah, no, 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 no. I just need to know where the button for up is. Okay, so you're gonna be going left. Go left at the roundabout. Yep. Oh dear. The first exit. No, sec last exit. I think you concentrate on one thing at a time. It's gonna be both, so it's more adventurous. Let's see, we're staying on this side. He's staying on this side and he's shifting with his left hand. Driving on that side. Building. Okay, yep. now we're. And then just keep going, and it's a left. <laughs> Four gear! There's a car behind us, making fun of us. No, no, don't worry about that car. 
I spotted some hills, John. Such a weird thing, not being able to grab a steering wheel here. <laughs> and and so turn right on this. Yeah, side. turn right there. Yep. Stay on that left. One mile. I like what we're doing. Good here. job. Good job, John. Just gonna get this for insurance purposes. Oh, you're gonna hit that curb. I am not. I can see it on the curb. <laughs> turn left. Listen, navigator. <laughs> Special to the Harry Potter bus. Whoa. That had Burger King ads on it. <laughs> Harry Potter and Burger King. Side swipe the little vine back there. It's halfway in the middle of the road. Hey, that navigator, close? navigator, yeah. where am I going? Go, go to the roundabout. So it goes all the way around over here, and then. It's an IKEA. Oh. Just got in the rental car, and am currently driving on the wrong side of the road. I keep telling myself. We're in Ireland. That's Ireland. That's Ireland. All these things are Ireland. Driving on the wrong side of the steering wheel and road? It's Ireland. It's exciting. Three hours later. What is that car doing? Wait, who's supposed whoa, to stop? Oh, what? <laughs> Isn't that a stop sign? Okay, so we've been driving on these tiny little roads. Very nerve wracking. There's no shoulder. It is just an embankment or a stone wall. People are like flying through, a little scared, but we're almost to our <laughs> destination. Okay, we found the chateau, we found the Cashel Lodge here in Ireland. You can't see much, but it's here. And we've driven these treacherous, skinny, tiny roads. And look at these dogs. Hi, doggies. Hey, hey, buddies. And there's our ride. That's Johnny. I'm going to bed. Oh, the Mount Cashel Lodge here in uh, Bunratty. Wait, what city are we in? Supposedly it's Bunratty. And I could have been naked. You should have had your door closed if that was the case. Not when we're roomy. Ha <laughs> ha And here's my room over here. A little floor window and a heater by the bed and kind of a vault here. And I didn't know it, but I get a bathroom of my own. Ha ha, sucker. Not bad, not bad. Thanks for following me this far. Stay tuned for the next one. Ireland was amazing. Be excellent to each other. And ta-ta for now.